if you could imagine the qualities needed to be a good judge, to be firm, fair, and honest. Court observers say you would find them in Judge Edward Cowart. Now the Dade County court system will miss him. He died this morning after a heart attack. He was one of the greatest, wisest men I ever knew. Uh, he was chief judge when I was sworn in as state attorney, and I watched him through some of the most difficult times in this community's history. I know of no man that had a greater sense of fairness and what was right and what was just, and this whole community is going to sorely miss him. Before he was making decisions on the law, he was enforcing it. He was a Miami police officer for six years before earning a degree to practice law. In more than 14 years on the bench, he earned nationwide respect, especially during the trial of Ted Bundy, convicted of beating to death two sorority sisters at Florida State University. Coward handled a trial with national exposure with the same down-to-earth calmness court observers have come to know. But he remained firm, like the time defendant Bundy, who often worked as his own attorney, raised a finger during a hearing. Since I have been in Dade County, I've been allowed don't to... Don't shake your finger at me, young man. man. Don't, don't shake your finger at me, young man. Of one and one half hours. That's fine. Me. You can shake it at Mr. Haggard. <laughs> After the murder conviction, at the day of sentencing, it was a compassionate Judge Coward who spoke to Bundy. Such a total waste, I think, <clears throat> of humanity that I've experienced in this court. You're a bright young man. You made a good lawyer. I'd love to have you practice in front of me, but you went another way, partner. Take care of yourself. Judge Marfonius remembers Judge Cowart. He was a friend. He was a caring person, a person who loved people. Uh, he would devote all of his time to helping people. There was just really no problem that was too small for him to exert his efforts on. Mel Taylor, Channel 10 Eyewitness News.